We hope that the mobilization will indeed change still the law uh, and the decision that has been taken. And that's also the reason why we are here with a huge delegation of international trade unions to uh, support our French trade unions because we can't accept this methodology nowhere in the world and certainly not in France. It's unacceptable. And today we see rising inequality throughout the world, terrible inflation. And in this time of terrible inflation and growing inequality after the pandemic and because of industrial transformation, instead of supporting the ordinary livelihood of the people, we see the Macron government using the undemocratic Article 49.3 to avoid public discussion while they try to tear down a pillar of the social system, which is the pension system. At the French unions here today, I think they're an inspiration to working people across Europe that you don't back down, that we have to fight for social change, we have to stop the, the gradual erosion of, of, of the social wage, which is what's going on across Europe. Euh, on a signé une charte sociale qui est respectée euh, par euh, l'équipe d'organisation des Jeux Olympiques. Les Jeux Olympiques, ce sera une fête, comme les événements culturels, comme les événements sportifs. Je crois qu'ils doivent pouvoir se, de, se dérouler dans de bonnes conditions et pas être entravés.